Hi, right, good morning everybody. How's everybody doing today? Today we are going to do a little bit of power washing. We're going to be uh, setting up for um, a patio concrete epoxy. Um, but um, we'll see how that goes. So today is just going to be power washing. We're going to take a little ride. So we just crossed the state line for North Carolina. on a patio and uh, yeah um, down in South Carolina but a lot of my work is still up here in North Carolina so right now um, just doing a little bit of uh, traveling and um, so until, until I get uh, established down there but my customers are up here so I still got to come up here and and do work I got good customers so a little ride but it's, it's worth it well we are here this grass looks like carpet <laughs> very nice area there's the uh, power washer gas and this is what we're gonna work on first i gotta cover these plugs okay got all the furniture out Cover these up and we're going to do a power washing and epoxy. Let me set up. Here we go. Oh, 
Got it power washed. Let this dry for a day. And then we'll be back tomorrow. I'm gonna burn some of this water off of it. It's a couple puddles. So give it a chance to dry for overnight. And we'll see what happens tomorrow. Uh, let's talk a little bit about the paint and uh, how I'm gonna go about going this epoxy on this concrete. Uh, first, clean the surface really, really good. Um, and we did that today. Now, um, we are going to use a uh, bonding agent um, I mean a sealer for the concrete. So what that'll do, that'll, that'll uh, make the paint stick to the concrete and you won't get any of the peeling and lifting up and stuff like that. So that's why we did a thorough cleaning. Um, we're gonna use a bonding agent. And uh, I've used a bonding agent before. Um, it's just a, um, I've used it on concrete walls. I've used it on steps, concrete steps. And so the stuff works really, really good. It actually bonds. You can use it to bond concrete with concrete, you know. Anyway. So, um, that's going to be the plan, um, depending how many hours um, I can leave the sealer on there before I paint. Sometimes you only have a, uh, a window of hours um, before you do the next process because if you let it cure too much, then you're going you're gonna to wind up sanding. So, now if you stay within that, that window of time where um, I think uh, on the epoxy is within 12 to 24 hours, you can apply another coat without sandy. Okay, we're gonna, just got back from the power washing, but the little power washer I picked up um, and uh, did the job. So I'm gonna unload unload the power washer and uh, get ready for tomorrow.
Yep. All sealed up. Get the sealer in it. Let it dry. And we're just about ready for paint. Good deal, good deal. Okay, we're getting here. There. Anyway, so far, so good. Hey guys, well, we're done. Um, they came out pretty good. So, um, like and share and uh, check it out. <laughs> well, this is it, pulling the tape off. This is what she looks like. Pretty awesome. All right, guys, thanks. Right, come on, Charlie. Let's go for a walk. Good boy. Do a little training. Come on. Good boy. Charlie's getting a little bit bigger. About nine weeks, month and a half now. Two, uh, two months and a half. Come on, Charlie. Charlie. Gotta listen. Come on. Good boy. Good boy.